Okay, so bicycle playing cards are bicycle playing cards, but the company over it is actually the. Not sure if you can see it there. It's on the seal of all of them. The U.S. Playing Card Company. The really cool thing about it, I guess, are all their, a lot of their products. Anyhow, not all of them. Surprisingly, kind of disappointing. Made. Made in the USA. Ah, made in the USA. Uh, I guess there's a lot of political discussion that we can have about it, but I'm gonna make it controversial because my view is kind of controversial. It's a little different. It's not for or against Made in America. It's more questioning of Made in America. First of all, Made in America doesn't have to be 100% Made in America. Um, I think it's like 70 or 60% that it has to be made in America. And then the products can be from somewhere else. Like the materials used to make it can be imported. But that's a little bit different. Th there's good to the Made in America movement. You're supporting a more local economy if you're in America. You're not supporting businesses in China or some other countries that don't have very good quality. Um, but you really have to look into it because Made in America doesn't mean necessarily better quality. It doesn't mean that you are supporting a business that is upright um, and standing. It's not necessarily morally right or any more morally right. They might be doing it just to get sales. Um, there's a lot of things t to do with Made in America, and you really need to look into the um, into the product and into the business and into the businesses that that business interacts with because you could be supporting a business secondhand by supporting one business with your purchase. The Made in America movement is pretty good, and you might want to desire you might desire uh, Made in America, but 100% made in America isn't necessarily any better than 100% made in Canada or Germany. You have to look into the company. Uh, some companies are just crooked, and other companies are very, very good. There's a lot of moral issues, and some people care about some, and some people don't care about others. And, uh, which ones are important to you? Which ones do you want to support? You need to look into it. I think it's an important thing as a consumer. I think it's one of the most important cornerstones of capitalism and pretty much any economy is who are you supporting and why are you supporting them? Money and cost and quality shouldn't be the only concerns. They should actually be after morality, in my opinion. So, what are your, what is, what would your response be? You, you can comment down below, you can give a video response, anything. I want to hear back from you. Uh, like it, dislike it, um, subscribe if you want to hear more of this political discussion. I hope I can do a follow-up, maybe a response to a video response. That would be cool. Till then.